There have been a lot of changes with Arizona State Athletics over the past year, starting with the new logo and uniforms for most of the teams. The football program seeing a lot of changes, but now most notably, Dr. Crow announced Wednesday morning that Lisa Love had been fired as Arizona State Athletic Director. Uh, we've run this path about as hard as we can run it, and so she's going to move on to something else, and uh, I'm going to be very supportive and, and am very supportive in her doing that. There, is there happiness about the performance of football uh, over the last few years? The answer is no. Uh, there's excitement about potential, and Coach Graham is sitting right behind you, uh, and so uh, he knows what his, uh, what his objectives are. Uh, is there happiness about uh, men's basketball? Uh, it goes unanswered. I mean, it's, it, how could you be happy about 20 losses uh, in a single season? And so uh, it is our expectation that our that none of our teams and none of our programs will be in the bottom tier of anything. Dr. Crow explained that Lisa Love achieved everything that they asked her to achieve, but now they want to achieve more. And that more is going to come from new athletic director Steve Patterson. Patterson, who has experience at the NBA as well as NFL levels, will now be the new face of Arizona State Athletics. If to go forward from where we are here, we have to have a vision of where we want to go as, as Sun Devil Athletics. And I think the key to that is Sun Devil Athletics has to win, uh, first and foremost. We need to be consistently competitive. We need to be uh, top ranked uh, in the Director's Cup every year. We need to vie for national championships. And while we're doing it, we need to have some fun out there. And I think we've missed a bit of that with some of the teams that we've had this year. Well, I don't know that a move by itself changes anything other than uh, who sits in the chair. Uh, but what it indicates is that uh, we are uh, so committed to our objectives that uh, we will continue to evolve the team until we have the team that can get it right. You know, we've got to be competing for Pac-12 championships every year. We've got to be a top 25 ranked team. You know, we've got to be winning the South. And we sat down with Coach Graham, for example, and said this is the level of expectations. And he said, you know, geez, if I don't hit that, you better fire me. You know, that, that's the kind of that's the kind of commitment we want to see. And I wake up every day and go, this is a great canvas to paint on. You know, if you can't figure out how to come here and be successful, it's not ASU's fault. You know, it's it's the person that's coming here. It's the it's the person that's coaching. Patterson said with conviction that if you can't be successful here, it's not ASU's fault. That should be an insight of the type of expectations that ASU has in athletics moving forward. From Tempe, I'm Jared Cohen for pros2preps.com.